Let's start with our song. Oh, do you know what time it is? What time it is? What time it is? Oh, do you know what time it is? It's story time today. Yay! Now you're going to sit with your legs crisscross like this. And my song goes crisscross applesauce, hands on lap, ginger snap, back straight, chocolate shake. Oh my rear root beer, lips zip, cool whip. Shh. My story for today is by Jane Yolen and Mark Teague. How do dinosaurs stay safe? Published by Scholastic. Let's see, a dinosaur of this size. How could a dinosaur of that size stay safe amongst people? Let's find out. How does a dinosaur, dinosaur stay safe all day? Whether at home or at school or at play? Does he climb up too high? Oh my goodness. Or jump on his bed? Does he race on his bike with no helmet on head? Oh my goodness, look at how tiny that bike is and how big that dinosaur is. Is he rough with the cat? Does he stand up on chairs? Uh-oh, that chair is tipping over. And look, here's the cat. The cat's running away. Looks like the dinosaur has a pair of scissors. Oh no. When mama says no, does he run down the stairs? If anyone dares him, does he always try to jump from the rooftop as if he could fly? No, a dinosaur doesn't. And I'll tell you why. When crossing the street, he holds Mama's hand tight. And he's ever so watchful to cross with the light. He's careful with forks, knives, and spoons when he eats. Look at his big, long fingernails, and he's using them to hold that fork. He, he never goes off with the strangers he meets. He just says hello to them. Hello. And the man says hello back. When swimming with friends... He is careful to be right at the spot where his papa can see. How can you not see him, right? He's huge. <laughs> he wears a good helmet when riding a bike. Look how tiny that helmet is on his head. Takes bottles of water when on a long hike. There's his little bottle of water. He's even got a straw. Always safe, never sorry. In playtime and fun, a dinosaur knows how to dial 911. He's careful, not fearful. So here's a big roar. Stay safe and play safe, little dinosaur. And if you can see, he's on this little tiny wagon. Isn't that something? So, yes, that big, huge dinosaur was able to stay safe after all, wasn't he? 
And you can stay safe too right now while you stay home or play and go to a park. Let's talk about some of the ways we're all staying safe right now. During this time when there's a virus and we're staying home a lot, we're staying safe by doing what? That's right. One of the ways we can stay safe is washing hands, right? And for 20 seconds, we wash with soap and that gets all our germs off. You can sing a song while you wash your hands. That will help you make sure your germs are all gone. We'll sing it just like this. If you're happy and you know it, wash your hands. If you're happy and you know it, wash your hands. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, wash your hands. And you sing it twice. And that's enough time to get all the germs off. Another way we stay safe right now is by wearing a mask on our face. If you're two years old or older, the Center for Disease Control recommends that everyone two years and over wears a face mask. And here's our ear, hole, ear loops. So we just put this over here and hook our loops behind our ears and we make sure we can see and when we go outside, we wear our face mask. And that way we don't share any germs with anybody. And this is a really good way to stay safe. Washing hands and wearing our face mask when we go outside. So my craft for today is to make a thank you note for all of those essential workers, such as doctors, nurses, your mail carrier, and delivery people, those are essential workers right now. That means they, their work is so important, especially for doctors and nurses to take care of people, to stay well. We have to thank them for all their hard work right now. They don't get to stay home and just be safe at home. They have to still go to work and be safe at work. So we wanna say thank you to them. So it's a nice time to make a sign to hang in your window of your house, your front window, or on your front door. So I'm actually gonna hang this sign up on my front door. And it says, thank you essential workers. And essential means necessary. The workers that, that need to keep working. They, they, they're providing us with a service that we need in order to be well. And you can say, thank you doctors, thank you nurses, thank you mail carrier. Thank you delivery people. You can put, make your thank you note, say anything that you want to any person who's coming to your house and helping you or somebody who you know is working in hospitals and doctor's offices to help those who are sick. And you can make a note with a grown-up's help in your house to write some words thank you and you can do some pictures and tape that up. If you make a thank you note to hang in your front window or your front door, please take a picture of that and send it to us here at Metuchen Library. We'd love to see what thank you notes you make and we'll share them as well on social media. Send it to the website you see at the end of this video. Thank you, be safe, and hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.